Hey, what is up heroes and welcome back to some more Pokemon Gold. Last episode, we got the second gym badge and made our way through Elix Forest to Goldenrod City. Did a little bit of grinding, so today we are ready to take on Whitney, the hardest gym leader in all of Pokemon in my opinion. That mill tank, too powerful. So done a little bit of grinding and everyone is uh, good enough level right now. The thing you might notice is Togepi right now is a male and not a female like she was last episode because uh, guess who forgot to save the game? This guy. Yep, forgot to save the game. Also off screen, I got the bicycle, which has got the best music ever. Love it. If you guys want to get the bike, just basically go behind the mart right here, down here, and go into the building here. Bike shop, talk to the guy, and you'll get a free bike. For advertisements, yay. So, with all that done, let's go and take on Whitney in her gym. Alrighty, here we go. Hopefully we're a good enough level. Just really worried that Miltank's gonna kick in my butt. Oh, you're a cute little trainer. I like you, but I won't hold back. Good to know. Alright, Beauty Victoria. What have you got? You got a Sentret. Should be pretty easy. I taught Togepi a headbutt. So now I can just headbutt everything. And battling her makes me feel like I'm super overleveled. We'll see though, <laughs> we'll see. I mean, once we get to that mill tank, it starts roll out in, and then we're gonna get absolutely wrecked. Another thing I should mention as well is I accidentally, because I was trying to get through uh, the game again, get to Goldenrod City, I uh, accidentally got rid of Ember for Cup. My bad, but it's fine, it's fine. Not the worst thing in the world, I mean, we'll learn a better fire type move soon, I imagine. I mean, Flame Wheel, it's gotta be pretty close. And Tuki's doing. Tuki's doing alright. There we go. Much XP 157. Yeah, nowhere near 17. I mean, with, uh, I'm thinking with Flaffy, we should be pretty solid against. Whitney, you can paralyze her mill tank, slow it down. If Togepi can outspeed, I don't think Togepi will outspeed it, but if it can, oh, 17 Sentra, oh my goodness, okay, I lied. I am definitely not under leveled or over leveled to the gym. For the level 9 Sentra, oh man, we gotta be quite over leveled, then bam, bring it to level 17. Saving the big guns for last. Please don't hit five times, please stop, please stop, please stop! No! Oh, I didn't want Togepi fainting. Ah, it's annoying. That's fine, that's fine. Let's go for cut. Get level 21. Come on, learn flame wheel. That'd be so helpful right now. Ah, oh, quick attack. Oh, I've got my hopes up. Just... Ah, oh, that really sucks. It'll come in handy, though. Just in case Mo tank does outspeed us and we need to do that last little bit of damage. Let's go right tackle. We've got cut now. Don't need tackle. So what level will be, is, is Flame Wheel in this game or is a Flame Wheel a uh, Gen 3 move? Pretty sure Flame Wheel should be in Gen 2. Anyway, I'm quickly going to heal up, I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, we're back, nice and healthy, let's continue through. There's good old Whitney. I am going to battle every single trainer here just to get the uh, little bit of extra XP. So we're going to need it, we need every little bit. I did actually try finding a Heracross before um, I forgot to save the game, however, I spent, I'd say a good 30 minutes just headbutting the trees where it's supposed to spawn. Couldn't get it. The rarest Pokemon I found was I found an Apom. I found Metapods and Cocoonas, I think? A lot of times I found nothing, but I found Apom like twice, but that was pretty cool. Wasn't sure if Heracross had to be a certain time of day then, or maybe even a certain day. But I was just headbutting that tree for ages, getting nothing. I was definitely at the right spot, but... Maybe not the night, right time of day. Alright, one more Pokemon. You got a Meowth again. Beat this, get level 17. Slash, don't get a crit. Ooh, I'm gonna switch out actually, I don't want Topi dying. Show me how to speed you. Ooh. 
Oh, the low HP music does not sound good above the actual battle music as well. <laughs> not good, man. Let's go off on the shark. Woo, so close. Hey, level 17, nice! Da, 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 da. Ah, I love the battle music and everything in this game. Oh, next person. Just love that. You know, the encounter music as well. Everything about this game I love. Love the good old graphics, love the soundtrack. Love the Pokemon, I love Gen 2 so much. We got Snubble, okay. I can probably beat a Snubble. Not a Togepi, of course, but... Let's go into... Cynical. Start spamming them cuts. Well, it might be a good idea to actually go check out the uh, department store. And see what TMs I can buy in Goldenrod. It's gonna be like, maybe like a flame... Well, I doubt flame for us, a bit too good this early on, but... It's gonna be like, a, at least a fire move I could pick up. I think we'll do that after, um... Ooh, nice critical hit. We take out all the trainers in Whitney's gym. So we have to heal up in a second anyway. Can't go find Whitney this week. Get absolutely wrecked. All right. Last train of the battle. I like cute Pokemon better than strong Pokemon. But I have strong and cute Pokemon. Ooh, lucky you. Jigglypuff, ah, it's pretty cute, but is it strong? It's gonna be Jason, I want to Jason level 21. I've been asked the question as well, what am I gonna make my Eevee into? And right now, I don't know. I'm thinking like, because I couldn't find Heracross, I'm thinking I'm gonna make uh, my Espeon into, well, my Eevee into an Espeon. So I want to get a Sneasel. And obviously Sneasel Dark types don't want Umbreon, do we? Or Ice and Dark. I don't know. I'm thinking Espeon. But realistically, it's probably going to be the, depending on the time of day I, I record the next episode. Well, record when I'm recording when Eevee wants to evolve. Sometimes I can record at night. Sometimes I can record during the day. If I want to record a couple episodes, then I'm going to have to uh, evolve my Eevee. It's going to help out. But if I get Espeon, it'll help with the 5th gym, whereas Umbreon won't, and 6th gym, not going to make a difference, 7th gym, not a difference, 8th gym again, not a difference. I mean, Umbreon won't be helpful until the Elite Four. So I'm thinking Espeon is probably the best idea, so we've got a nice Psychic type for Chuck. Yeah, let's go with Espeon, I'm going to get 100% get Espeon now, I think that's the right move. Let's just hit. Oh, okay. Can okay, I just save my tackle? Fine, I'll go with them shocks then. I don't mind. I don't mind, Jigglypuff. Oh, so close to 21. Oh, no, 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 no. Alright, I'm going to go heal up. I'm going to go check out the uh, department store as well. Probably get some potions as well to help out, but let's see if we've got any TMs we can use. Alright, we are back nice and healthy. I did go to the department store and you can actually buy Fire Punch and Thunder Punch. However, Qualava can't learn them just yet, which uh, really sucks. Flaffy can, but I thought Flaffy's going to learn Thunder Punch as an Ampharos, I'm pretty sure, so there's no point using it Thunder Punch. And Fire Punch, I'll just save for Tuckalusion when we get it, but by then probably won't even need it and don't really need Fire Punch to be fair on Flaffy right now, but maybe we will teach it because it could come in handy for the 6th uh, gym, we'll see. Let's take on uh, Whitney. I remember, I think at one point, when I first played this game, I might have beat her and not pay attention, just left the gym without going back and talking to her, but I can't remember. Hi, I'm Whitney. Everyone was into Pokemon, so I got into it too. Pokemon are super cute. You want a battle? I'm warning you, I'm good. Oh, Whitney, we know. The past, what, like 20 years, I've known you're good. Well, not 20, but I'll say, what? When this game came out, 2000? Past 17 years, I've known you're pretty good. <laughs> Level 18, Clefairy, okay. Headbutt. I'm going for a metronome, try and risk it. 
Might get lucky. That's spending time. Okay, risk it for the biscuit! Come on, metronome. Oh, I missed. Nice. Give me something good, like Focus Blast or anything. I don't know. Substitute. I mean, that's pretty good. Can't complain with that. Don't disappear, though. No! That sucks. Haze. Okay, not good. Nope. Last metronome. Hidden power. Oh, what is it? <laughs> I should just kept spamming them um, headbutts. Would have been a lot better. Probably would have done a lot more damage. I want Togepi to get the XP, and it missed a double slap. Nice. Cut's gonna have to do work right now. Stop. Hey, stop. Bad Clefairy. Oh, you live on HP. You are so lucky. I doubt your potion up. Alright, goodbye, Clefairy. No tanks coming out. Yeah, we want to switch. We want to paralyze that bad boy right away. Strongest Pokemon ever in a gym battle. <laughs> Alright, Thunder Wave. So I really want to try to get Heracross just to help beat this. Don't fall in love. Yes! Nice one. Jason fall in love with no cow. Let's go, Jason! Get him through the, uh, get him through the attraction. Stomp. Okay, we're good. Oh my god, that stomp does so much damage. Might have to switch out, I can't. Oh, nope. Usually, like, I'm always falling in love, but... Jason's doing alright. Oh, this is not good. That stomp does so much damage. Alright, okay, that's fine. Still got... Quilava. He hasn't even gone for a rollout yet. Oh, not attract. Okay, got a plan. It's not a great plan, but it might work. Leer! Don't be in love. Not good. Oh my god, we're gonna die if we don't heal up. Should I bought more potions. Please get paralyzed like once. It's like paralysis doesn't do anything to it. I'm just gonna think of a cup. It does 24 damage. Nice. Not enough. Milk drink. No. Oh, we're gonna lose to Mill Tank. Like, he has not been paralyzed once! This Miltank is just... getting off scot-free! And we just fall in love all the time! Like... I, I doubt we're gonna win this. Togepi, you, you just gotta flinch it every single time now. I mean, that's uh, one. If you flinch it every single time, I, I swear. Fully paralyzed. Okay, there you go. Finally got paralyzed. Critical hit. Nice. Nah, it's over. Oh my god, Whitney. Too strong. Alright, let's try this again. So I need two Pokemon. It shouldn't be that difficult. I think saying that. I mean, I want to switch out just to get the XP for, uh, for our Tuki. Got a plan this time. It's not a great plan. The first thing I'm going for is a Leer. <laughs> Metronome. Okay. Thunder Wave. Oh my god, are you serious? That's annoying. That is very lucky for you. Watch me get paralyzed all the time. Unlike that mill tank getting paralyzed once. It's ridiculous. Can 
can, you can learn Kai if you want. <laughs> Go for it. So close. Right, I think now I'm going to get rid of the paralysis. I'm going to heal up as well. Metronome, don't get something terrible again. That's fine. Alright, let's use an oral potion, heal up. Fine, okay, that's, that's fine. Fine releases if I beat it, right? I mean, I can switch out, I hope. Surely it should do, yeah. Now time for the middle tank. Alright, let's go Jason. Alright, first things first. Thunder Wave. You need to outspeed it. For some reason, no tank is super fast. Don't be in love. See, this is why you, 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 uh, Whitney is so... Oh god, no. So difficult. The attraction, the milk drink, the rollout. Alright, we've got the thunder wave off. Alright. Now it's gonna go for the thunder shocks. Do as much damage as we can. She needs to get paralyzed, otherwise we lose. That's another problem. He's looking for the love. I mean, if she's stuck in the roller, it's fine actually, because we can get one more hit off. Please, one more hit, one more hit. Yes. Right. Should still be in this. Alright, I want to go into Tuki. We can flinch it, or oh, if she can get paralyzed just once, that will save us. Flinch. Yes! Let's go, don't milk drink. Flinch again. Stomp. That's fine, that's fine. Honestly, it's really fine. Flinch, 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 flinch. Fully paralyzed, beautiful. Give me a crit, give me a crit. Finish it off! Flinch, flinch, flinch! Yes! Come on. There we go! Toga P coming in clutch. So all I want to do is just flinch it once, right, stops the rollout, and then uh, Qualava could have came in, beat it. So either way, I was pretty good there. I need a charm. Sweet kiss. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> You're mean. You shouldn't be so serious. You, you child, you. <laughs> ah, <laughs> you meanie. Oh no, you made Whitney cry. It's okay, she'll stop soon. She always cries when she loses. What? What do you want? A badge? Alright, I forgot. Here's a plain badge. Alright, got strength out of the bow now. Also boost your Pokemon speed. Oh, you can have this too. Is that a tract, I guess? Yeah. Alright, now let's get out of here. Gotta make our way to Equitique City. That was uh, such a difficult gym battle. I think this would be a second time, you not that bad. Just when that milk tank milk drank first time round, you, kn you knew it was over then. Actually, when she used a track, you, like, you kind of knew it was over. Do, 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 do. Right, before we actually head to Extra Tick City though, we actually need to get the water bottle. Because a certain Pokemon is just chilling and he blocks the path. Alrighty. Get to use my bicycle as well. I love the soundtrack of the bicycle. It's just so cheery. Can't help but put like a smile on my face. Anyone want to go in here? Yeah, talk to you. Oh, you're better than Whitney? Do you know about that moving tree? 
If you wet it with a squirtle bottle or squirt bottle, it attacks. Squirtle bottle sounds like such a cool name, but since you have some badges, you should be okay. Got the squirt bottle. I'm gonna call you the squirtle bottle. <laughs> Alright, cool. La 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 la, have plenty of water, my lovely. <laughs> okay. Cool thing is we did a little bit of grinding as well on the way to Critique City. But for Morty, I'm pretty sure we're going to have to do a lot of grinding. So I'm pretty sure he's level 28 Gengar. So for uh, next episode, we're going to make sure we're pretty tough. Because next episode we're going to do the Burnt Tower. And then, uh, then battle Morty. Got a Vulpix level what? 15? It's not bad, I can take that out. I need to try to get Tuki level 20. So keep using, keep using him, not her. I only get like a Togetic soon as well. That'd be nice. Oh, and then flinches. No, not Ember! Not enough 7 damage. I was expecting like, good like 15 maybe. Not bad at all. Defeated Kim. <laughs> and more trainers. I don't mind battling these trainers just because we need a little bit of XP. So, it's all good. Usually I'd be trying to avoid all these trainers, but right now, XP's good. Alright, Sand Shrew. I think as well, like, you've got the bug catching contest up north, but I think that's only on a Tuesday, and today is... Monday? Sunday. I don't know what day it is today. It's Monday or Sunday. <laughs> oh man, I've been so, such a bad sleeping pattern, I've lost track of days. That is just horrendous, I should not be happening. <laughs> Anyway, that's Sand Shrew gone. This Togepi with Headbutt is just destroying everything. Togepi is a monster. Meryl? Okay. I could deal with a Meryl easy. Roll out. Oh, okay. I'm not gonna lie, depending on how much damage this does, I'm a little bit scared. Okay, I'm a little bit scared. Oh, we should live one more roll out easily. Right, next head about should finish it off. As long as we don't get critted here, we should be fine. Yeah, we're fine. Or as long as, as long as we don't miss as well. If we missed, oh, we're gonna be switching out. I should probably stay in just to have the HP ready for Flappy to thunder shock it. What's up, girl? Beat your boyfriend. My boyfriend's weak, so I can't rely on him. Oh, ouch! Oh, that is that is awful. She's savage. She is such a- oh, that Pikachu surprise is really cute, but she is such a savage! Oh my god! Oh my god! That is just... If I was a boyfriend, I would just be, like, gone. Just destroy, like, evaporate, like, just gone. You know, just spontaneously combust, you're, you're out of there. <laughs> Ooh. But oh my god, cut us a lot of damage. Yeah, one more cut. You know, I'm starting to think actually the bug catching contest might be every day. It might be like special rewards. I'm thinking maybe like a Tuesday you get something I'm thinking of. Maybe it's like a Tuesday you get a cipher. Or a metal coat. That might be it. You get something. I can't really remember. If we can do the bug catching contest, we'll, we'll have a go. It's not that far from a critique. Got a Diglett. Okay. Level 10. I might better beat it with some headbutts. 17 HP. Magnitude don't get a 9. Okay, I take it back. This could hurt. Now we're fine. Oh, nice. One hit. Damn, Togepi. I'm gonna zoom If we stay in and switch out, Togepi should get enough XP to get level 20. I'm gonna Jason go for a Thunder Shock, and I think Jason should get 21 as well. Oh, I don't know, that's asking, asking quite a bit. 21. Considering it's level 10 Zubat. Don't think Togepi will even get level 20. We will see though, we will see. Yeah, I thought it was asking a bit too much. And yeah, Diglett, oh, we'll switch out for that. Go back in a Tuki. And then we'll go for Qualava. Oh, level 14, no, I don't want to risk that. That would definitely kill me.
Magnitude, don't get. Oh, seven. That's gonna hurt. Should be fine though. Just not a critical hit. Wow. Not cool, dude. Still take out one hit though. Right, I think we desperately need to heal up before we do anything else. Alright, cool you go heal up, I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, we're back nice and healthy and I'm pretty sure one of these guys has a bunch of Voltorbs and he has like two Magmas? We'll see. Yeah, Magma. The other guy has like four Voltorbs. Each scaling in level, I think it's like, like 6, 8, 10, 12, 14? Something like that. Fire Punch. Oh, too good we can take that. Imagine you're like a, a cool fire duck looking thing and you lose to an egg. That's embarrassing. My little cute took good beats of magma. Eh, you got a magma, yeah. Level 13, ooh, two levels higher, can I actually do any better than the last one? Yes it can, because it gets a crit. Not cool. Oh, if you didn't get a crit, I could so beat you. Time to switch out. Five punch, yeah, we should take that. Oh, you got another critical hit on me, what? Dude. Calm yourself. Damn. This functional bet take you out otherwise. Oh, are you serious? Okay. Cool lava, out you come. You gotta take a fire punch. Cause this dude's just not having any of it. Not seriously smog. Got another crit You've had three critical hits on me! On each of my Pokemon, dude, calm yourself. What is wrong with you? Damn, son. Don't want about the Voltorb going, I want to run away. Okay. So, bug catching contest. I think I'll talk to this guy. We hold contests regularly in the park, you should give it a shot. Okay. Who do I talk to to start it? Ooh. The music's really nice for this area. But I think maybe we'll leave it for now. Well, let's think we'll do and she start it. Oh, okay. I thought it was a little bit different, but we're good. Got an ice barrier. Eh? I vote we go back to the good old Gen 2 days where berries were called berry, ice berry, burn berry. Instead of all this like petcha berry, orange berry, all that terrible stuff. The psychic mark has an abra. Right, if I'm right in saying this should only go for teleport. So I should be able to just headbutt it to death. Oh, it's got flash? Okay, flash and teleport. Damn, Togepi! Headbutts are killing it! I just got pretty good. Oh, we're gonna have Abra. I think it's the last Pokemon's probably gonna be Kadabra. Lower flash, lower my accuracy, it's fine. All we'll do is land the one head button, you dead! Oh my god, so many flashes, please land. There we go. Critical here as well. Oh, come on, that's unfair. That, that XP is at the end. I should be level 21 right now. Alright, for Kadabra though, we'll go into Quilava. Just go for a nice cut. Because I think we'll probably know, like, I don't know. Psychic confusion, something. Confusion, yeah. Good, I switched out. He 22. Good stuff. Still got a long way to go for uh, Morty though. Don't really want to take on that Gengar without being level like 26, 27 the latest. Oh, another trainer. What up, man? Thanks to my uh, studies, I'm ready for any Pokemon. 
Good luck, dude. Do, 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 do. Got one Pokemon. Got a Tangle. Okay. Oh, the color of a Tangle looks so weird. It's like so bright. Even though Tangle is quite dark, right? I'm struggling to see what Tangle looks like now. Or color looks like. I'm pretty sure it's dark. Pretty just let a Pokemon go and check, but. It's almost like a dark green. Time. Oh, gonna miss. Sweet. And get hit by poison. Oh, this battle, you know, it's gonna be a pain in the butt. Critical hit. Poison getting critted and constricted. And missing attacks. What more? What more could you want from me? This is just not good. And my speed dropped. Great. Still outspeed it though. Not that it makes a difference. So we're gonna die. So I'm hoping Flaffy can beat out. Really? At this point, I really wish I taught Flaffy Fire Punch. Might have to after this battle, to be fair. But we're gonna have to go heal up because we can't battle Pseudo Wudo like this. Finish it off. No, you live like 1 HP! Oh, that's so unfair, dude. So unfair. Alright, tackle, finish it off. Oh, I thought we missed for a second then. If we missed. Devastated. <laughs> Alright, I'm pretty sure next up is Pseudo Wooders. I'm going to quickly go heal up. I'm going to try and capture it. But we'll see that. There it is. Looking very funny. <laughs> Alright, catch you guys in a second. Alright, we're back. Nice and healthy. Saved it. Let's try and get this, uh. This Pseudo Wudo. Oh, doesn't like the squirt bottle. The weird tree attacked. Pseudo Wudo. Every time I say it, just think of that <laughs> one time he tries pretending he's a Trevenant. Just chilling. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's sweet kiss it. Gotta get that confusion. And do a little bit of damage to it each turn. Those headbutts. Can't hurt yourself, hurt yourself, hurt yourself. Very nice. I haven't got many balls, so this could be a struggle to get. Run out of a headbutt. Oh, I spell it this time, don't flinch it. Won't hurt itself. Come on, one more time. Ah, oh, no. Right, I'm gonna go into Jason. And then we can Thunder Wave it. I might even go for attack, to be fair. Unless it hurts itself right now. Nope, got through, but missed the rock throw, nice. Confused no more, fully paralyzed, cool. Go for a tackle. That's like nothing to how. It's fine, it's fine. Keep going for that then. Bring down a red HP. We know we can't kill it like this. You can mimic my tackle if you want. Alright with me. Get fully powered. See why can the mill tank be like this? Get paralyzed like nearly every turn. Right, now it's paralyzed, red HP. We should have this in the bag. Alright, great ball, let's go. Yes! Got the first go. Brilliant. Not gonna use it, but. Just had to catch a pseudo Wudo. Okay. There's one more battle. I oh, can avoid that battle, I can train up later. Oh. Pokemon can't do a thing if they are asleep. I'll show you how scary that is. Oh, great, don't put them to sleep. Although, actually, when we get to Equity, there's gonna be one thing we're gonna do first. Just talk to one person. That way, off screen, I can get. Get Eevee, so we can train it for next episode. And get that Espeon. Alright. Oh, Hypnosis actually did put me to sleep. Great. Thanks, mate. Appreciate being put to sleep. It's my favourite thing about Pokemon. Actually, no, it's not. It's, it's falling in love with... Ah, the attraction. It's just so annoying. 
Dream here, cool. Oh, hypnosis. Oh, let's go. One more headbutt. No. Oh, come on, wake up. Wake up, Togepi. Ah, oh, that really sucks. Damn it, Togepi. Alright, let's go into Jason to find a shock. Right, come on. Don't put me to sleep. Please don't put me to sleep. Oh my god, seriously, no hypnosis. Dude. Oh my god, this this drowsy. Just, he needs to just stop this. Oh my god, really? This is the worst trainer all of Pokemon. Oh, come on. Alright, it's up to uh, Quilava. Don't you dare put me to sleep, dude. Do not put me to sleep again. Please don't, please don't. Oh my god, seriously? <laughs> he was not kidding. He was not kidding, he actually kept putting me to sleep. Oh my goodness. No, I think he gets HP back from Dream Eater. Wake up. Yes! Die! Yes! Never again. Never. Again. Okay. Oh. Almost. Almost like Critic City. Ooh, Growlithe. Very cool. But we don't need Growlithe, we've got Typhlosion. Right. I love the music of Critic City. I forgot about this. Oh. Is that who I think it is? A Bill? Hi, I'm Bill. And who are you? Hmm, Voltsy, huh? You come at the right time. Just finished adjustments on my time capsule. You know that Pokemon can be uh, traded, right? My time capsule was developed to enable trades with the past. <laughs> you can't send anything that uh, didn't exist in the past. If you did, the PC in the past would have a breakdown. So you have to remove anything that wasn't around in the past. Put simply, no sending new moves or new Pokemon in the time capsule. Don't you worry, I'm done with the adjustments. Tomorrow, time capsules will be uh, run well, at uh, all Pokemon centers. I have to hurry on back to Golden Run and see my folks. Bye bye. Alright, cool, cool. So, we're going to end this part here. Next episode, we're going to go to the Burnt Tower. Gonna uh, go take on Morty. That's the next episode. But off screen, I'm gonna run back to Golden World City. And there's a house to the left of the Pokemon Center. Go behind the Pokemon Center to the left. And you'll find Bill in there with his folks. Go and talk to him, and he'll give you an Eevee. Which we're gonna try and make an Espeon. I doubt we'll get it to an Espeon for next episode. But I will start grinding it into an Espeon if I can. But thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace.